Hey everybody, this is Jenny with Clayton Homes in New Braunfels, Texas, and I am bringing called the Angelina. Now the Angelina is actually a remake of a house we used to carry here called the Tallulah. You'll also have heard it called, oh gosh, I have to think of the old name, not the Amy. The Amelia, sorry, there we go. Used to be called the Amelia. This is from the Clayton NXT Athens factory. Now from the Tallulah and the Amelia, they've made a couple of changes. So this is the new updated version of that house. So one of the major, major things that they did is they have changed this little area here on most of their floor plans. This used to be where a pantry, like a dedicated pantry was. Now you have, whether it's a coffee bar area, you can still absolutely use this for pantry space. It is around the corner where guests aren't gonna see it. You can always add additional shelving here in this area if you wanted to actually keep it more for pantry. But it also gives you a really lovely drop back and really pretty area if you wanna use it more for decor. Now also, just like you have here, the shelving and the countertop, that is also an option here we opted for the pantry option on this home. So this is now an option and it's just a nice stack pantry so that you do still have a dedicated pantry space in this kitchen, or you can have additional open shelving and make it look even more farmhouse style. Tons of space as always. There is a new option. This just came out this last week, so I don't have a home here that has it. They went, they used to have the microwave over the stove. They no longer option that at all. They have these new vent hoods, which are really pretty, but they do now option. Instead, you can have a microwave installed here instead of the pot and pan drawers. So it gives you the option to have the microwave installed or you bring one and you do a countertop model. Now this home again, this is a four bedroom, two bath with what we call the extended living space. So you've got your main living room as you walk in and you can set this up whatever works best for your family. We usually set it up as a second living area, but if you've got a really huge table and you entertain a lot, well then use that entire space for a table and turn it the other direction. If you want more of a game room for the kids down at this end of the house, then turn your couch around the other way and face it toward that wall and stick the TV there. So there's just a ton of things you can do with this. Let's look at bedrooms real quick. This factory is always known for really great bedroom sizes. So this is a 12 and a half by about 10 and a half and great walk-in closets. Oh, with an extra door stored. <laughs> Can't see as full as well, but big, big, big walk-in closet. There you can see the depth of it. And so really nice spaces. Now the other thing that this factory has changed, I'll show you in the other bedroom. Maybe we'll get a better look at this closet. They've also switched to where they used to do gypsum, which is your panels with your strips. They used to do gypsum in all of their closets. They no longer do that. Everything in this house is now full, regular sheetrock, tape and floated drywall. So full finishes throughout the entire home. There's your furnace door, guest bath, kids bath, Beautiful finishes, they do the furniture style vanities, which is lovely, full tub and shower. Toilet is packed around the corner so you get some privacy. Beautiful natural light coming in with Nissan in the background. This is actually the water heater access panel here in this bath. So easy to access for maintenance and everything else. Bedroom number four is here. Again, another nice size bedroom. Now this is the only bedroom that does not have a walk-in closet, but it still has a great wall closet. And then you've got an end entrance with your utility room, space for a freezer, end entrance to the side of the house if you wanna have a driveway down the side of the house, and your full utility room. Great little folding table still between. They used to offer that before, so they kept that, so we're really happy about that. Now, this house, any house that this factory builds that has this end entry can also be flipped. So if you say, hey, Jenny, I need this house, but I need the door on the other end of the house, I can flip this house over. Any of their homes that offer the end entry, I can do that with so that you have the entrance on the side you need it if it is already something where you're designated, like where your driveway is gonna go. All of these are also standard with a sliding glass door as well as the farm sink 
and the stainless steel appliance package, those are standards in this line, this entire line. So they have tons and tons of beautiful floor plans we can pull from. One of the things that people love this line for is this master bathroom. So we're going to give you an idea. Now, one of the things they did change is they now give an option. If you do not want a bathtub, it used to be standard. If you do not want or would not use the bathtub, now you have the option instead of putting a second open air closet in that space. And I'll kind of show you what that looks like. But here's your master bath. So again, the furniture style, but this is a dual sink vanity window in between so you get all that gorgeous light. There's your pedestal tub. Now what you can do here instead is this would actually have closet on both sides where it's open, open door, keep the window, and that way you've got hanging there instead of the tub if you would not use the tub space, or you can just leave it open. Beautiful tiled shower, and this shower got larger. So their old showers used to be a 48 inch shower. This is now a 60 inch shower. So gorgeous, gorgeous shower option. Toilet again hidden around the corner, and this huge, huge walk-in closet. I'm actually gonna walk in it because, again, this used to be gypsum wall, and now it's full sheetrock, and this is an L-shaped closet, so just to give you a little bit better idea of the feel for it. So it's factory again. One of the things that's great that's come from COVID is a lot of the factories have reevaluated what they're offering and have come back out with new features, new ideas, and things they were kind of forced into doing because of shortages, but really, really good options, really good upgrades, really nice new features. So this is one of the ones that we actually sell quite a bit of. Uh, again, this home is called the Angelina. They have multiple other floor plans. They have three bedroom and four bedroom floor plans that are available. So if this is something you're interested in or like more information, please email me, J-E-N-I dot W-A-R-E at ClaytonHomes.com. You'll also find additional contact information for me in the description of the video. I look forward to hearing from you. Thanks again for watching.